With the Kenya's cooperative movement ranked in the first position in Africa and seventh globally, Kenya boasts of over 15,000 registered cooperative societies. Thus, as they join the rest of the world in marking the 94th International Cooperative Day at Uhuru Park Grounds. <laughs> Members of various cooperative societies were cognizant of the tremendous strides the country has made in this endeavor. <laughs> Industrialization Cabinet Secretary Aden Mohamed, while leading the celebrations, called for value addition in agricultural produce. One of the biggest opportunities that we have in our country today is the lack of value addition of our products, especially agricultural-based cooperatives. And I would like to encourage as many cooperatives as possible to really pursue the issue and the agenda of value addition. Under this year's theme, Cooperatives, the Power to Act for a Sustainable Future, Mohamed said the government is committed to ensuring Kenya's cooperative enterprises remain strong and sustainable. The government has in the past released over 4 billion Kenya shillings as debt waiver and a further 2.4 billion has been factored in the 2016-17 financial estimates to cater for the remaining coffee debts. It is my expectation that farmers whose debts have been waived will take advantage of this gesture to increase coffee production and therefore the incomes of players within this sector. With the country facing a number of challenges such as high poverty levels in rural and urban areas, members of cooperative movement say things can change if Kenyans fully embrace the culture of savings through circles. For us, the difference between a main loan and an emergency is not there, because all that loan is provided within two days. So most members now actually, instead of going for an emergency, they're going for the main loan, because they're the same. We've also embraced technology. We are using the brick and the concrete uh, 3D technology to build our houses so it becomes also affordable for our members. We enable our members to access real time the information or their statements that they have seen. Uh, we do that through a portal which we have put in our website and it's also accessible in your mobile phone. It is estimated that around 80% of Kenya's population derive their income through cooperatives despite some cooperatives being faced with various challenges. During this year's celebrations, trophies and certificates were awarded to cooperatives which excelled in various categories. Ben Chumba, reporting for Channel One, News Hour.